Violence continued to grip Egypt's capital Saturday on a day when more than two dozen people died in civil unrest in the Mediterranean city of Port Said, northeast of Cairo. Months after more than 70 people died in violence at this soccer game between teams from Cairo and Port Said, a judge handed down death sentences to 21 defendants Saturday. Additional verdicts are expected to be handed out in the coming weeks. This footage from Cairo Saturday shows supporters of the Cairo team cheering the verdicts, but the reaction in Port Said was violent and deadly. Saturday, as rioting gripped Cairo and other cities, security officials said 27 people were killed in Port Said and some 400 wounded, many by gunfire. Meanwhile, anti-government protesters attacked the headquarters of Egypt's Freedom and Justice Party, which is the political wing of the Muslim Brotherhood. It all points to the country's continued volatility two years after Hosni Mubarak's ouster, with Egypt defined by a struggle between ruling Islamist and mostly secular and liberal opponents. Egyptian President Mohamed Morsi vowed to restore security in his first months in office, but critics say he's failed to carry out promised reforms of the judiciary and police force and waged a personal campaign against opponents of the Muslim Brotherhood. Carlotta Bradley, The Associated Press.